Okay, so you have this smart Wi-Fi water leak detection that is operated by, you know, in this case, it's a triple A uh, battery that provides three volts DC. And well, over time, this tends to fail, right? I did a modification in this unit here. Instead of using the, the batteries, I'm using the AC-DC adapter. Uh, that provides the same 3 volt 1 amp uh, and the modification here i already have one one is closed here the other one is open here and it's actually plugged in that wall as you can see the power now is being provided on the the wire uh, the positive it's the red the negative it's the black if you mix this it will not work because it's dc power but it's not gonna burn anything, so you just gotta switch uh, the 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 size, and it will work. Uh, of course, if I still need to operate with uh, double A or triple A batteries, I can just unplug from the wall, insert you know the batteries here, and it would still work normally as it's supposed to, as it comes from the factory. So this unit now, as you can see, as I said, it's already plugged in. Uh, the probes are right here. I'm going to wet my finger and touch those two probes you see that there's going to be a light here, the blue light, showing that there is a something, you know, detecting uh, water right here. So I'm, I'm, I'm wetting my fingers here now. I'm going to touch the probes and see, you see a, a blue light right there. I'm getting a message on my phone at, at this very same time. Uh, so I should be getting a message on my on my watch as well. So as I said, I already have a notification here. I'm trying to get here with one finger to pull down and you see flood warning, swamp pump just now because I touched those two probes, as I said. If I do it again, it's going to show a blue light right there. I'm going to dismiss this and yeah, see another, uh, another notification here so yeah it, it keeps working uh it's going to be way easier to maintain i don't need to be replacing batteries uh all the time it, I, my experience is that this consumes a lot of battery it's like every three months you need to replace batteries i don't know what was happening here it was defective but you need to buff both of these i don't want to be replacing batteries all the time so think about it do this modification uh, very cheap. This runs about two dollars and fifty cents at uh, Amazon. Amazon. Uh, these units, it's kind of twelve, fifteen bucks each. Uh, combined, it's going to be, you know, around fifteen, uh, seventeen dollars, and then you're gonna be safe.